What's up guys, it's your boy Lazarin doing another video again. This topic, I'm going to talk about the Houston Astros season right now and how big of a threat they is to win the World Series again. Everybody please like, subscribe, comment on my YouTube channel. Everybody go subscribe to the T-Ball, my boy Swishers out, and my boy Tony the Late Show. They got some great NBA content, so y'all guys subscribe to their channel. They got some good content. But anyway, the Houston Astros are 30 games over 500 right now. To me, I think they're the best team in baseball. The second best is the Yankees and Boston. They both fighting it out. We're, right now, we're six games up. On the Seattle Mariners, Oakland is not too far behind. They one game up. Tonight we play the Texas Rangers. And we got the best pitching rotation in the baseball right now. We got the best hitting lineup, one through nine, in baseball right now. We're striking out a lot. <laughs> Something we didn't do last year. We made more contact than we struck out last year. But every bat down that lineup is a dangerous bat. Jose Altuve, the reigning MVP, is the best in the league. He's starting to strike out more. George Springer strike out a lot. Carlos Correa strike out a lot. Yuri Duriel grounding too many double plays. But right now, the positive is the starting pitching. Every time the Astros play, you got a feeling they can win every game just because of Garrett Cole and Dallas Keuchel, Justin Berlander. Charlie Morton and who is that? Colin McHugh? No, Lance McCullers Jr. There we go. We got the best five in baseball right now. So the Astros have a great chance of winning the World Series again this year. They can hit. They can play great defense. They can pitch. They got good position players. Tony Kemp has been a good hitter for us. Kyle Tucker will come on. Carlos Correa has been hurt. We had six All-Stars. How about Alex Bregman, man? Alex Bregman is a great player, man. I mean, that dude is a stud. He is hitting the ball all over the field. <laughs> but Jose Altuve is the reigning MVP last year. He's a pretty good player. He's second in batting average. He's got nine home runs right now. Like, there's no way you can hide. You can't walk a player because they can make you pay. Evan Gaddis coming on strong is a good, versatile player. I'm kind of glad we moved Jake Marisny to AAA. Let him find himself. But the Astros is great. They're a great team, and I think we have a great chance to be back-to-back -back World Series champs. The other night, we lost to the Colorado Rockies 3-2. to two. In 10 innings, Charlie Blackman hit a walk-off home run. And I agree with Alex Bregman. I think that call was bogus. Alex Bregman hit a leadoff triple. Really, got to third base. The game would have been tied. No, we would have won the game. It would have been 3-1 at that time. That was a big issue. Umpire, you can't make that call. Can't make that call at all. That was a bogus call that he made on Alice Bretman. Ain't nowhere in the world. Ma, you telling me Manny Power would have caught that ball. Going into the wall. Just because the fan tipped it. He would not have caught that ball. That would have been a tough play. And then he was off balance falling down. So I thought that was a bogus call. We ended up losing 3-2. to two, But we still 30 games over 500. We still up 5 games in the West. And I think we're going to win the division. And I think we're going to have a good chance to go back to the World Series. And I think we got the best team in baseball. I will be back on here tonight giving my reactions of the Houston Astros versus the Texas Rangers. I'm out. Everybody, subscribe to my channel. And everybody, show love to my boy, the T-Ball. Switches out. And my boy, Tony the Lake Show. I'm out. Peace.